As for many of us, the scars from that day are still very fresh. Joining me this morning is Fire Marshal here in Ashland, Marguerite Hickman. You guys are holding a very special ceremony this morning here at Fire Station 1. We are. We're holding a remembrance ceremony for those who lost their lives at 9-11 at uh, the World Trade Center collapse. And why are ceremonies like this still important 13 years later? You know, I think this is uh, an event that's really something that, one, we feel we need to honor those that were lost. You know, there were over uh, 400 first responders who were lost also, and so that's one reason for us. But I, I also think that it's important for us as a nation to remember that this actually happened. And I know one of the former students here at the fire station gave you guys a very special gift after the whole the whole situation happened. Can you talk to us about what we have behind us? Sure. The, the picture that's behind us is uh, called A Prayer for My Brother, and it was painted by William S. Phillips or Bill Phillips. And he's actually an Ashland native, world-renowned artist. But um, after 9-11, uh, he was really inspired to paint this picture. Um, and basically, it's Oregon, two Oregon firefighters who were um, paying tribute to those who were lost. And uh, B Bill Phillips actually was also a, started out as a student firefighter with Ashland a few years ago, many few years ago. And the community is welcome to go and come join in on that ceremony. You're asking people to gather at the flagpole at 6.50 this morning, is that correct? Yes, our ceremony this morning will be out on the steps near the flagpole, and we are asking people to show up by about 6.50. Um, it will start at 6.58 and go through a, a moment of silence. We'll have a traditional bell ceremony and um, just a time of remembrance. Perfect. We're going to have much more. We're actually going to show you a piece of one of the World Trade Centers in just a bit. Stay with us.